How's it going everybody? Today we got a very rare box of 2003-2004 Upper Deck Ice. I've never seen a box of this stuff open so I was very excited to pick one up and open it up on the channel today. The unique thing about this box, the checklist is very very small. There are only two different autograph sets in the entire print run. There are autographs like Wayne Gretzky, Bobby Orr, but obviously we're going to be looking at the rookies. We're searching for Marc-Andre Fleury and Patrice Bergeron. The Ice Premier Rookie out of 99 for those top two guys goes for some big money which is the reason this box is so expensive now before we get into the box just want to let everybody know that we have our friday night group breaks posted up if you want to join in on any of those breaks please check out that first link in the description and as always we will be doing a giveaway on this video we're going to be giving away the majority of the contents if not everything that we pull in this box today to one lucky winner all you got to do to be entered into that giveaway is be subscribed to the channel you got to drop a subscribe drop a like and drop a comment all the rules for that giveaway will be in the description and the month of december giveaways will be at the end of this video so stay tuned for that now without further ado let's get into this super rare box so there is one of the autographs that we're going to be looking at, the under glass. I think those are one in every eight boxes, I believe. And then there's also the jersey autograph set. So a lot of stuff to chase after, but if we're going to be looking for those rookies, it's got to be the top two. Here's the old checklist. Got some marks on the front there. And all the packs. A lot of packs. 20 packs in this one. Let's see how it goes. All right, here we go with pack number one, Jumbo Joe on the front. Let's see what we're going to start off with. I've never seen this stuff opened up. I had to trace down a box for you guys to see. We got Patrick Elias on the base, Mikey Moe. We'll take a look at the back here. Sort of has that same feel as the MVP with the indents on the card. Uh, looks like we got our first numbered card. It is going to be out of 999 rookie in the first pack who is that sergey zinov i have no idea <laughs> out of 9.99 these do look great though the ice premier rookies this year look gorgeous there's only two tiers tier one is going to be out of 9.99 and then tier two is out of 99 so like i said small checklist we have a good shot at getting a 99 rookie but uh, that is not the one we're searching for that is our first rookie i think we only get one more of these so hopefully the next one is a little bit better <laughs> And we got Marin Hosa in the Ottawa uniform on the back. Pack number two. I assume there's going to be a lot of base packs in this stuff, which we will just skip. Looks like we got a decoy here. Base. Decoy. Oh, we got a jersey. Jersey in our second pack. We're two for two right now. Colorado Avalanche dual color jersey. David Abisher. Another player I don't know much about. These do look great, though. The acetate patch two colors. I know there's a patch version out of 25, which would be wicked. And they do have hall of famers and legends in this set to chase after. So we got two packs down one rookie, one Jersey should have two to three more hits to come. We got Doug Waite on the back pack. Number three base base, another hit coming. Who is this going to be? We got an acetate rookie out of 999 Dominic Moore, New York Rangers. So maybe uh, we're going to get more than just a few hits here. Ice Premier Rookie Tier 1, Dominic Moore. 3 for 3 right now. All right, pack number 4. Can we continue the hit streak? We got a Marc Messier base. Our decoy. And we do. We have another jersey card. I think we might get more than 4 hits in this one. That's a beauty. Brendan Shanahan on the Detroit Red Wings uniform jersey. This is the clear-cut winner's it should be game used. Yep, game used jersey. One color. Love to see a Brendan Shanahan. So hopefully we get more than four hits. I don't know what to expect from this product. Like I said, I've never seen it opened up, but only four packs and we got four hits already. Let's continue. Pack number five. Looks like we got a lot of base here. Brett Hall in the Detroit Red Wings uniform. There's a decoy and Minnesota base on the back. Next up, I think we're going to have some base packs coming. We'll get through them. Nope, we got another jersey. We got an Icebreakers jersey. This one's going to be out of 75, Rob Blake. That makes it back-to-back -back great names, Shanahan and Blake. We will take that all day long. It is so cool seeing these sets that originated in 2003 that are still around in 2023. 20 year difference and they are still around today i have no idea what to expect after this you were only supposed to get two jersey cards and two rookies and we've already exceeded that number so here we go we got looks like a whole lot of base in this one there's jumbo joe on the cover boston bruins uniform we got the upper deck decoy and 
and Mario on the back. All right, final pack on the right side. There's been a ton of hits on this right side. Let's see what we can finish off with. There's Francis. We got the young Patrick Marlowe, Carter Base. Congratulations, decoy. Uh, definitely expired by now. And is that Thomas on the back? It is, no, Andrew Raycroft on the back. Okay, we start the second side. The left side, can it top the right side? There's Jeremy Roenick. Hopefully there's not all base on this side though. Matt Sundin, another decoy. And Stevie Y on the back. What do we got? These are upside down here. Upside down base. Rick Nash. Yager, that's cool. In the Rangers uniform. Can imagine getting an autograph of him. Base. It's not looking too good. We might have base the remainder of the box. Pavel Datsuk, Naslin, Broder, Jay Bomeister. This is our best base pack so far. And Chris Jury on the back. All right, so we got three packs left. There's been zero hits so far on the left side. Let's see what we got. Looks like another base pack. It is. That was Korea there. And base. Okay, final two. I was all excited that we were going to get like five, six hits. But uh, we've slowed down. It looks like we got a rookie here. Be a 99. Tier 1, so it is not a 99. Maxime Kondratev. Oh my gosh, these names have not been good to us. <laughs> The rookies have not been kind. That one is going to be the first one stamped, though. Not that it means anything. One out of 999, first one stamped. Some Leafs fan has been searching for that first stamp on this card for 20 years, and we pulled it today. <laughs> that is funny. We got the decoy and base, and let's see what we got in our final pack. Can we get something a little better than those two jersey cards? Let's see. Looks like we got all base, unfortunately. There's Iggy. We got the congratulations, you got a decoy. And then we finish off with a Rick DiPietro base. And that will do it. All right, so there we have it. We did beat the odds. We got six hits instead of four. Not that it mattered, though. <laughs> we had the Rob Blake and Brendan Shanahan. That is definitely uh, the two hits of the box, the two nice ones. And everything after that wasn't too great. The Frozen Fabrics jersey, Colorado. And our three rookies were uh, gross. Nothing to write home about on those three. But that is the risk we take with the older boxes. It was fun to explore that box. I've never seen it opened up before on YouTube. So I was happy to share that experience with you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. We will be back later this week with another upload. Until then, we'll see everybody on the next one. Here we go for the month of December giveaways. Good luck, everybody. Thanks again for the support on the channel. If you do see your name pop up here as a winner, please shoot us an Instagram DM or an email and we'll verify your account, get your item shipped out to you. And we will not be replying to people in the comment section. If you do see any replies, that is not us. Please avoid that at all costs. And good luck. Our final random here. The SP Game Used release date is going out to Curtis. Congratulations, everybody.